arts and as a third generation native Chicagoan. Andrew Panther became one of the city's most influential social and cultural critics, earning international attention. Earlier in his career, he was editor and staff writer at what at the time was WFMT's Chicago Magazine, and then a staff reporter for the Wall Street Journal. Later, he was an on-air arts critic, program host, and producer for WBEZ before returning to WFMT Fine Arts Radio and WFMT.com, critic at large and interviewer in 1998. He has remained there for more than 15 years. He has contributed to some 2,000 pieces of arts criticism to the Chicago Sun-Times since 1991 and has been its classical music and opera since 2006. He started covering LGBT subjects and giving an open forum to activists in 1979 as the 19-year-old editor-in-chief of the Chicago Maroon at the University of Chicago. He was the first regular writer for a mainstream Chicago paper to write openly about being gay and was the first regular Chicago radio host, producer, and contributor to do the same. He was also an early Chicago House volunteer. Panther was educated in Chicago public schools and the University of Chicago and the University of Wisconsin at Madison. His work has appeared in numerous periodicals and on broadcasting stations around the world. As you can tell from the program booklet in more detail, you can see that more in detail. Um, for this distinguished career in the arts and in activism tonight, the Chicago Gay and Lesbian Hall of Fame welcomes Andrew Panther. Thank you.